My name is David Smith. I'm the 505 Program Director, and I've been at Bell about 10 years. I love the missions that our customers are able to do with the aircraft, uh, the variety of things that our products do in the world, uh, from saving lives to moving uh, equipment around the world, uh, developing uh, energy sources, just an amazing array of missions. So as Program Director, I'm responsible for the entire end-to-end -end delivery of the 505 to the market. And so that covers everything from engineering release to supply chain activity, where we make partners with uh, suppliers out in the, in the global space and uh, make sure that we certify the aircraft on time and then eventually deliver product at a competitive cost to our stakeholders and customers out in the market. It's a, it's a big effort, uh, very complex across multiple sites. We've got some, uh, team members in our Canadian facility in Montreal and we've got team members down in Mexico supporting the build of, a, of one of our cabins. Uh, so we have quite a bit of activity all around North America. We set up a culture of high collaboration, so you can see the environment we're, we're working in is a very open environment, trying to make sure that there's a lot of information flow, uh, things don't sit. Um, typically when, when there's uh, team members that are dependent on each other, uh, they're invested in making each other successful, so that's a big part of what we've developed in this culture. We also really wanted to make sure that everyone uh, tackled this with personal ownership, and I think that's been a big big part of this, this team. We, we certainly stress people by putting a lot of responsibility on individuals, uh, where in other programs it's usually split across multiple people. Uh, but we think that that in the end has improved the quality of the outcome and the, the quality of the design. This product is extremely cost competitive and it needs to be kept at a very low price point to, to meet our market requirements. And so everybody in the business can help control cost and that's an important part of what we've done on this program from the beginning. We're entering a critical phase where we're transitioning into production and entry into service. And so our customers are going to start interacting with the Bell Customer Support and Services Organization and our, our facilities that are building the aircraft are going to start receiving parts from our centers of excellence in Fort Worth at the Rotor Center and the, and the Drive System Center. We need the facilities within Fort Worth to produce cost-effective, high-quality products uh, at our schedule and requirements. And this volume, the aircraft volume, is so high that it is a real challenge for all of our, our facilities to keep up. And on the customer support side, the variety and diversity of the customers we're going to be working with on this product um, are more, uh, more complex and more varied than what we're used to seeing in our, in our larger aircraft. And so it's important that both of those organizations, integrated operations and customer support and services, understand the change that we're about to go through with these hundreds of aircraft that will deliver to a variety of customers that we haven't worked with in, in a very long time. We've delivered a product faster to market than any product in Bell's recent history. It is a great testament to what can be done with a small team and a very focused objective. You staff the team right and you set up the right culture. It is, a, it is an amazing thing to watch where you really turn the engineers and the designers and the analysts loose on an aircraft challenge and, and you get a product in the end much quicker to our customers that meets their requirements. It's a great opportunity to watch a product development really go at full speed.